Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Fuxan and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing season two, episode 19, a sort of online association called Awakening. So we start off with Kurito is finally awake and he starts to battle um, Poe, which is Prince of Hell. And so they have a really cool action scene and then right when um, Poe is about to like hurt Kurito like really bad, like literally really bad, uh, we get to see Yuji's spirit helps Kurito uh, and throws it back and then unleashes the, spe um, the special sword skill from his sword and kicks all the players out of the game, pretty much. And literally, his sword is back, which was so freaking cool to see. I was like, oh, what? So, like I said, all the players got, um, got walled out of the system from everywhere. And then... Uh, then we find out that Poe cannot get the life resources that he could last time, and that Kurito could, so he has learned all the power, and they're both gearing up to go at it. So after a really cool action scene, Kurito literally breaks, I think it's a cleaver that Poe had, he literally breaks it and him, but does not kick him out of the game. He turns him into another cedar demon tree, and literally... That started happening, so that was kind of what really cool. And then we have like a really emotional moment between everybody, and especially like you had a nice Asuna and Krita moment, which I thought was really good. And just, and also Klein too, like he was super happy to see him, so they hugged and everything. And it was just all around just a sweet moment between everybody. I thought it was really good. And Krita healed everyone as well. And I just thought it was just a really, really cool moment. So, Kurito and Alice are going to go see, um, sorry, Kurito and Asuna are, are going to go get Alice and take her to the altar to log out of the game. Then we cut to back on the Ocean Turtle where the bad guys literally have eight hours left before they need to complete their mission and it's not going too well and they need a key to turn on the acceleration again. And then the guy has another idea. Then we cut to where Higa is being patched up back at the um, the sub control room, thanks to Renko and the nurse. And so they try, they're trying to figure out another plan. But before they can do that, we find out that the bad guys literally busted up the machine and they have 15 minutes for like um, acceleration. And this is not a good one at all because like usually... It's like at 1,200 or 5,000 that they can see it. And it's like the, what is it called? This It's like a disc enabler got turned off. So uh, it's not looking good. So they have 15 minutes to log out all the um, floodlights and the SDLs out of it. Otherwise, it's not going to be good at all. So what they need to do is he needs to get back to where he was and so the head guy is going to go with him along with the guard and also we find out that um, he got connected a line to Kurito so they can communicate with him directly for like a C12 line so they actually do that and tell Kurito like you got 10 minutes to literally get out of the game otherwise like 200 years is going to pass like that and your consciousness may never recover from that. So you need to get out as soon as possible. And so Kurita's like, okay, that's fine. I'm gonna come back with Alice to so be prepared for that. So they're going so they're still going to go meet Alice and uh Kurita is flying, which is pretty cool. So he really gears up and goes towards that world altar. And then we cut to where Alice says goodbye to her dragons because she sees Gabriel coming and she told the dragons to actually leave leave, but they didn't. And they started to fight Gabriel. And as Gabriel's about to attack them, Kurito broke it up. And then it's going to be Kurito versus Gabriel. And that was the end of the episode. Really good episode. I really, really, really enjoyed it. I gave this episode a plus. I thought it was really good. And I'm very excited to see what's going to happen next week. They're kind of leaving this on little cliffhangers. But I love action scenes. I like the storyline. And, uh... I just really, really am enjoying this season. I feel like it's a lot better. So anyway, that's going to do for this video. So like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell what you think of the episode. Do you agree, disagree? Tell me your thoughts down below. And don't forget to subscribe because it does help out the channel a lot. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye, everybody.